Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 5 of season 2 of Magical Recordings. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> so we're going to see Madoka's POV today. Really? <laughs> Okay, YouTube channel. <laughs> oh, was that supposed to happen? Oh, okay, never mind. It's too quiet. I feel like something's gonna scare her. <laughs> Which I wouldn't be mad at it. And if you touch your shine, you shall leave. Bam! There we go. Oh, I like the shoes. Oh, is she under? Is that the other version of her? No, that's still her. No. You I did not think they were going to show that version. Oh, 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 oh my god. Stop it. Oh shit. Oh my god. No fucking way. Oh. <laughs> I remember wanting the shit out of that card because I remember when you see the original transformation and then you see that version and how dark and scary and twisted it is, especially with the music, I was always like wanting that card. Never came home for me, and it's especially when I played it at JP and then of course because Ian never really got to the point of that, which, you know, rest in peace Ian's version of my, uh, Magical Recording because like I really thought that... That game, especially with this, with the Western audience, I thought it would have lasted a lot longer than it did. I mean, last year really was the death of not only that, but the Symphil Gear game because that came out and that was out for like less than three months and then that died. And I think at around the time I was still watching Symphil Gear and I said, yeah, let me get finished completely. And then I'll play the game, even though I was still playing it, because I didn't want to get spoiled on some things and such. Thank God I didn't get spoiled, but... Oof. Y'all really slept from that? Mm-mm. I could not do that.
Well, yeah. Unless you want to go with her. God, your voice is so pretty. Of course, she's going to steal some fun. <laughs> yes, but a good thief, not a bad one. Okay, now once again, go find your girlfriend. <laughs> well, you know, Felicia, that was the signal. <laughs> when it comes to Gilco, it's just like, fuck it, let's go. <laughs> the witch is fine.
know. But then this is also a reason why we need to know a little bit more on Toka, Uis, and Watch Your Faces Pass. Because it's like, we still know little to none. And I understand, yes, the game still has everything. But because of the fact is you're not always going to get a fan translation the anime is typically kind of going to give you a half-ass, like, answer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay but my thing is how the fuck are y'all three gonna get out before y'all get killed well there you go but if you do this you might die
Mm. But she has to, though. Yeah, but what else are we supposed to do? I mean, we in it. Woo, guy! Huh, they're not. No, I don't think so. But there's still so much that, you know, when you wasn't around them, they was plotting some it! I'm guessing this has to be the moment where Iroha is gonna go against Toka and Nemo. Because I know we're getting close to it. And I know I ain't played that battle because I was nowhere near that part. Crow But what if you die? That's a lie. That is a motherfucking lie.
If Corelli dies, I'm suing. <laughs> like, oh my god. Do not do this to me. <laughs> like, please. She's so precious and I love her. And I need her to see you like one more time before this show goes. Because I think like officially we're now at the halfway point of this show. And I think the show is gonna end in like the next few weeks. Um Oh god, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh my god, this is too much. But, whoa, Jesus, you know what? Let's just know. I'm going to go ahead and say this. I kind of thank God that I, um, I'm happy that I kind of stopped playing this game, but then at the same time, I'm kind of upset because I did want to know, um, truly, like, everything of what happened, like, specifically after the Aroha situation in season one and such. But, because of the situations of I was playing too many games last year, and then I think the first time when I played the Japanese version of this, there wasn't, there, there was translations, but there wasn't as much. And then plus to the fact is it took forever um, for the story to come conclude. And, you know, because, you know, especially because with updates, as someone who used to play um, Project Tokyo Dolls that is officially ending in October, which is still sad for me because I've been with that thing for, like, the beginning. Um, waiting for updates on certain stories and cases and everything. It is very tedious, trust me. But at the same time, when you stick with something, it's just so good. But now I am fucking scared about what the hell is going to happen. Especially with Curly, because she's an anime-only character. And she might die. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm getting triggered again. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> this fucking bitch. Oh, God. I still love Toka. Even though, like, Sometimes the things that she does, I don't agree with. She's still one of my personal favorites. And it's funny because, like, typically I will always like the villain more than the heroes and stuff. Like, I mean, oh, God. <laughs> it started with Jim Co. and then it got worse. Like, even in a any type of, whether it's an anime, um, live action, whatever, I'm always, like, when it is a female villain, I'm like, yep, mm -hmm, best girl, love her. Mm. And the next thing you know, they die, and I'm like, okay, that's fine. Move on to the next person. But, oh, God. Shit has finally got real. <laughs> we, we gotta die. Like, oh, my God. Jesus Christ. These girls, these magical girls. <sighs> Iroha and Madoka are our only hope right now. And Iroha is on our way. Madoka, where you, where you at? <laughs> Oh my god, like, at the moment when we need goddess Madoka, like, <laughs> bring her down to the heavens. Oh, Jesus Christ. I have no idea how in the world this is going to conclude. They, it, they're going to have to show, I think I've seen, like, a little bit of, um, some points in the game. Because specifically, because, like, that's when, 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 um... Iroha and Kuroi were running down the stairs. That's where I immediately assumed we were going to get that quote-unquote, like, semi-final battle where it is technically Iroha, um, Yachido, even though Yachido was doing her own ish, and she's on her way to Iroha as of right now, as we're talking and such. Um, but it's like, a, it's a final, semi-final match between Iroha and Toka for, like, <laughs> one last time. And such, but I'm guessing they're not going to show that until we get to the final episode or the second to last episode where it's either Iroha and Ui, because Ui still has to show up, right? Um, this is so complicated. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm so 
scared and excited at the same time. Like, uh, I can't. Like, uh, my girl had to summon the most powerful fucking witch that always creeps me out every single time. Hell, even seeing her when we got the fucking, um... Project Tokyo Doll slash Monica Magica collab like years ago in Project Tokyo Dolls and she was in the game except she was like she wasn't mm, I think well she didn't take up the whole screen she took like the like a little chunk of it still seeing her I was like oh my god I was like Jesus Christ I feel like I'm watching like the last two episodes of the show all over again but oh uh, god this is mm. oh god I can't <laughs> too much and we're only at the halfway point of this episode i'm not even this episode this season and i'm just like oh my god how in the world is this going to conclude with how many of our episodes that they have left with this show but we ain't gonna know until we find out and see in the next following weeks but other than that guys that was my reaction for you towards episode five of season two of magic cover credit if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the national squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next saturday for episode six bye guys